Hello everybody, my name is Angelo De Jesus. I'm the shipping manager here at Robertson & Sons Violin Shop in Albuquerque, New Mexico. And today I want to show you guys how to pack your cello so that you can ship it to its destination safely and easily. You will need two soft foam blocks, each measuring four by four by four inches. Place the cello inside the case, securing the scroll and neck straps. It is important that the scroll be suspended and not making contact with the back of the case. The proper way to suspend the scroll is to support the upper back with additional padding. Insert one block under one side of the bridge and the other under the other side of the bridge. The block should fit snugly underneath the strings. If you don't have foam blocks, you can substitute paper towels folded to the dimensions. In the hotter months, say April through September, I like to put a piece of wax paper underneath each foam block. This is going to keep the foam blocks from imprinting onto the varnish if it gets soft in the warm weather. Secure the bows in the bow holders. Include all of your contact information inside the case as well as any other instructions concerning your return or repair. Then secure all latches. A box for a full-size cello should measure 56 by 22 by 14 inches. First, place four to six inches of bubble wrap in the bottom of the box and center the case in the box. Next, stuff bubble wrap all around the case to keep it snug inside the box. If you're packing a cello in a soft bag, completely wrap the cello in its bag with bubble wrap. Then surround it with styrofoam packing peanuts. Next, you're going to tape all the sides securely with packing tape. The cello is ready to go. Your local shipping provider will generate your shipping label. We recommend that you ship via UPS, FedEx, or Southwest Airlines cargo. Don't forget to add the fragile and directional stickers. Remember guys, if you have any questions about packing or shipping your instrument, please call me here at Robertson's Violin Shop. Thanks for watching.